Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the, what, 22nd, but you know the timing is fluid, you know sometimes these readings resonate a week later, the same day, uh, in a month, whatever, the timing is absolutely fluid, we're just going to see what comes up, what kind of message do I have to deliver today, what's coming in, what is about to happen? What is about to happen? Or what has happened? Or something like that. Page of Swords. Oh, it's okay. So this is a message is coming. It's probably not a good one. This is conflict. This is conflict. This person doesn't look very happy. This is some sort of information that has come through that is, I don't want to hear it. This is an um, uh, unwelcome message by the looks of things. Looks like some people are coming as well. And this guy's ready to battle, ready to fight. So there could be an argument that is coming, ready to fight, you know, right, guarded, um, wet, ready. So it looks like this guy is ready. There's somebody that is coming. This guy is on guard. Uh, it could be a hostile situation. Um, somebody may have been caught off guard, but they know that these people are coming. So, yes, these people are coming. And this guy is ready to fight, ready to fight, ready to defend themselves, very defensive energy. There could be some news of legalities, some legal things that are popping up, okay? Either way, this person is ready. They're ready, they're ready. They've seen it coming or were, was, was told, was told that this is coming. So there's something, this is unwelcome news. Um, and somebody is ready. They're ready to battle by the looks of things. Um, be ready. Be ready. Get ready. Okay. Get ready. Be get ready to defend yourself because this is defense. Okay. Get ready to defend yourself. Six of Pentacles reversed. Something is being taken away. Something because there's been an abuse of power. Okay, there's been an injustice with the Six of Pentacles reversed. Somebody is mean. They are very controlling. This is uh, somebody that is um, doesn't adhere to professional advice. Somebody that is very dominating. Um, as abuse. This is abuse of power. Take so something is going to be taken away. They're they're losing some sort of um, stability by the looks of things. Um, Something is slipping away. Something is being taken away. Hmm. Somebody may be taken away. Leaving. Somebody's leaving. Um, oh, the full reverse. Foolish behavior. Somebody has acted foolishly. Somebody has acted foolishly. They did something without thinking. They did something without thinking. Now they're paying the price. This is paying the price. Somebody is about to pay. They're, this is paying. Instead of receiving, this is paying. Somebody is about to pay a price for their foolish behavior. They acted foolishly. They acted recklessly. They didn't listen. Somebody refused to listen. And now they're about to pay the price. Okay, that is definitely going to... That thing is so stiff. There we go. So, um, reckless, foolish, heading for a fall, unprepared, totally unprepared, but get prepared. Somebody was unprepared for what was about to happen. You know, they made, they did something foolish. Now they're going to pay for it. Hmm. Ooh, this may hurt. This may hurt. Or it did hurt somebody. This is pain. The Three of Swords is pain. But this is taking the knives out, taking the swords out, and bandit bandaging up, putting on a band-aid. Putting on a band-aid. Um, it's still pretty. It's raining, so it's still pretty um, stormy. So there's some sort of situation. It's stormy. But... There's healing here because the three of it's there's bandit there's a bandage, so there's some sort of healing, healing from some sort of pain. Somebody is healing from some sort of pain. Hmm. Interesting.
It's, there's still some cloudy weather, though. Putting on a Band-Aid. There's somebody, somebody has been ha, had put on a Band-Aid. Whatever that means. Queen of Swords reversed. Now, the Queen of Swords, they, somebody could be dealing with a real nasty individual. This person is very malicious, very vindictive, very revengeful. So a revengeful individual here who um, is telling a lie. She's This person is lying. They're not telling the truth. Somebody's not telling the truth. This is somebody who is hard to deal with. Somebody is, is dealing with an individual that is very hard to deal with. This person really hurt them in some way. There's lack of reciprocation. It's a one-sided situation. We have somebody here that is very vindictive. It's like they just want to hurt another person. That's what this is. Like I want to they say they want to. They want to hurt another person. King of Wands reverse. Now the King of Wands reverse is somebody who is very egotistical, gets angry, flies off the handle. Somebody may have flown off the handle and they're dealing with a real nasty individual that doesn't care. This one doesn't care, doesn't doesn't care, you know. We're not going to just put a band-aid on this because this was a band-aid. We're not. This person is very harsh. So we have a very 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 harsh. Very matter of doesn't care. Not about it's not about putting a band-aid on this. It's about the facts. You know what I mean? So this person is is probably upset, and this one is too. Somebody flew off the handle and did something stupid. Now they're about to pay the price. There's a message coming. It's not a or somebody's coming. Somebody is coming. Get ready to defend your defend yourself. And this could be legalities, okay? It could be uh, because somebody acted in a foolish manner, they get caught. Something happens. We have a vindictive individual here that doesn't care about feelings at all. It's not about your feelings. It's about a vendetta. This is a vendetta. You can't control your temper. This is somebody who can't control their temper. You can't control your temper. Hmm. Five of Cups reversed. This is uh, seeing that there's another opportunity. This is another opportunity to hurt somebody. That's what this is. Somebody has grabbed on to an opportunity to hurt somebody. That's what it looks like to me. This is a this is a revengeful, an act of revenge. That's what I see this as. We have somebody here that um, has been in a deep de depression. They have. They've been in a deep depression and they see this as an opportunity. They see this as an opportunity to um, act out of re re uh, or revenge, but this is also healing and l focusing on the future. So somebody, we ha this person is bitter. Very, very, very bitter. This is a, this is healing and and realizing that there's another opportunity. So somebody maybe maybe very hurt because the Queen of Swords in reverse is somebody that is very very hurt, hard to deal with, does act in a vindictive manner. This person has been focusing on some sort of disappointment. Something may have happened three times. This has happened three times. I'm done. I'm sick of it. I'm done with it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to patch myself up and move on. I'm going to take this opportunity to move on. Something like that. Something has happened three times. I can't, I'm not going to take it anymore. That's what it, I'm not going to take this foolish behavior anymore. This is, a, this is some, somebody who has gotten angry. I feel like somebody has gotten angry. They have done something foolishly. You know, now they're going to pay because this person is taking this opportunity as taking a new opportunity. Taking a new opportunity. An opportunity to... Um, win 
win, win, win some sort of battle because there's been a strong competition here. This person wants to win at all costs, by the way, with this card right here. Just wants to win. And this is some sort of competition. Somebody, somebody is dealing with a strong competitor that wants to win at all costs. All costs. Now the High Priestess is somebody that is very receptive. Somebody that listens. So there is something that is about to be revealed. This person has been waiting for the moment to reveal this information. And the only reason they've been waiting is because they want to hurt. They want to hurt. You know, you may have, it's like they want to hurt the person that is healing. It's an act of revenge. It is definitely, be prepared for an act of revenge. I'm sorry, but that is what this is. I'm not saying that you should go and do this. You absolutely should not because then you'll be the one that pays. Somebody is going to pay. Okay? Somebody is going to pay. The King of Wands in reverse, somebody that is unreasonable, somebody that loses their temper, somebody has lost their temper, somebody heard, this person hears, somebody heard, they observed, they 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 heard it, whether they something has happened. I mean, this is a very intuitive, very receptive, very reflective. Now, the high priestess is somebody who is very self-sufficient, very independent. Um, she sits back and she waits. She waits for the moment to reveal. She's, she's a very spiritual individual. And she's about to re... This is conflict. Highly competitive. We have a highly competitive individual here that has some sort of information that is going to hurt another person. And they're doing it out of their own pain. They're doing it out of their own pain. They are. So this is an intuitive that knows. Now this intuitive knows that this was going to come back. Something is coming back as well with the five of cups reversed. Something is coming back to that hurt you. It's coming back around to be dealt with again. Okay. It's going to be dealt. We're going to deal with this again. It's not over yet. That's what I feel like. This game isn't over yet. It's not over. It's going to, we're going to deal with this. We're going to deal with this. Be prepared for a message that you don't really want to hear. This is a conflict. Somebody is coming. They're not done with you yet. There could be news of legalities or news that we're going to, we're going to deal with this again. We're going to hash this out again. Something like that. Because I feel like that's what this is. Be realizing that this is another opportunity. This person has been waiting for the opportunity and now they have it. Somebody's dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. This is a, this is somebody that is very egotistical, loses their temper, male or female. This person is going to be paying the price. Doesn't matter what sign it is. Somebody has lost their temper. They're going to be paying a price. This person has been listening. They've been waiting for the moment. They predicted this was going to happen. They've been waiting for the moment for it to happen. Now that it's happened, it's like they they may be getting the law involved because there's there's law here. There is. There is. There could be some legalities here coming up. This person is highly competitive. They just want to win. This is foolish behavior. Somebody has acted foolishly. Five of Wands reverse. This is the a competition, strong competition. Coming up with a solution, though. But this could also be a full-scale battle. I do feel like it's a full-scale battle. There is an opportunity for solution if everybody can listen and cooperate. But it's like there's a lack of cooperation here. This is a this is like a full-scale battle. It's a fight. I feel like somebody sensed that they were going to get another opportunity to to grab onto. They sensed it and they and they waited for the moment and now they got it. Hangman. Now there could be some punishment that is coming. The hangman reverse. Somebody may be getting punished. They may be getting arrested. They could be, you know, something like that. I mean that the hangman reverse is punishment. 
There could be a new perspective that is needed and somebody maybe somebody just can't learn their lesson. They refuse they don't learn their lesson. They can't control their temper. And there's a strong ego here. So we have somebody here that is losing their temper and they they could get arrested. They could get arrested, they could go to jail, they could they could be put in handcuffs, they could be taken away, you know? They could be taken away because they can't control themselves. And maybe this was um you know, the high priestess, somebody predicted it, predicted it. You know, they were, it's a, it's, it was predictable. It was, it was, part, it's, it's definitely part of the script anyway, because the high priestess her, holds the script. We have this bitter individual. This is prolonged grief. And this is hurting, who has been hurting, 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 hurting. And because of her, this person's hurt, they have been battling, you know, wanting to fight, wanting to fight, wanting to battle, wanting to compete. You know, that's, that's, that's when somebody's um, pain, they're, re they're reacting to their pain. Somebody is reacting to their pain in a negative manner. Now, this person this person may also be the one that is paying a heavy price. It's fo being foolish for sure. This person is being foolish as well. Let's talk about this Queen of Swords in reverse that is acting in a vicious manner. Um, highly competitive, very much in a state of, of pain. You know, acting out of their pain, acting out of their sorrow. Ah... Uh, very upset over, um, you know, there's a lack of love here. There's a lack of happiness. There's no emotional growth. There's bitchy. These are bitchy women. These are, you know, not your friends. This could be your neighbors. Um, this could be your neighbors, somebody in your community. There's a lack of, of friends here. We got somebody here that is very um, alone. Okay, very alone. Doesn't Doesn't love themselves. Very sad. So this is a very sad individual, and the only way they can get attention is to act in a vindictive way. So that's what we got here. We got somebody here that is has a self-image problem, and they're and they're feeling alone. They're feeling alone. Um, there's an unrequited love situation. This is a drama queen. They were they lost. They were insincere. They're feeling cheated, and they'll do anything to win. So this Queen of Swords is. Um, very, very, very competitive, this Queen of Swords in reversed. She wants to prove, this. it's either she or he at this point, this person wants to prove that they can win. So they're going to do anything in their power to prove themselves. But I feel like this person is... Are obviously going to lose something because of these two cards being in reverse. This Queen of Swords in reverse probably doesn't have a lot of friends. Lack of lack of friends. Lack of um, well, she's not very kind. Nobody likes her, and that's why she's doing what she's doing. She's a gossip. But this party is over. This party is over. And she just she's sick of the party. She's sick of the partying. Maybe there's children. So I'm not sure if this is a neighbor and there's children. And maybe she has some children or whatever. We have somebody here that is going is very upset. That is very upset because of the partying, because of the because of the noise. Maybe there's too much drinking going on. And she's putting up a stink. So somebody could be putting up a stink, a really, really big stink. I feel like this Queen of Swords in reverse, though. Um, I feel like she's, she's lacking. She's lacking in her, in her own way. She's lacking friends. She's lo lacking emotional maturity. She's not handling the situation very well. What's going to happen for this queen of swords? I mean, she's mad. She's really mad. She's mad. Maybe she's been dealing with people that, um, have been taking advantage of her because it's, they've been taking advantage of, of her and now she's, she's pissed. So we definitely have somebody that that is pissed and I think they're getting the law involved somehow or something like that. Um, 
Ten of Cups reversed. Now, it has to do with the home or the family, trying to protect the family. Got to do what's right for my family. Got to do what's right for my children, you know? So I feel like there somebody there's going to be a message that is delivered. It has to it's coming from a woman. This woman is causing a strife, okay? This woman is causing strife because of her friends or her family or her status or her loneliness or her bitterness or because of revenge. She's causing strife and she is going to do something that you didn't even see coming, okay? She is, she's going to do something that you didn't even see coming because she has to prove a point. And she has to prove this point because of her lack of, of of her own bitterness. She's bitter. And maybe maybe she's proving a point because she has kids and she's trying to protect her family. She's trying to protect her kids or whatever. But this woman will stop at nothing to win. She will stop at nothing to win. And she's going to win. She's going to win. I think she has some information that is going to reveal somebody's anger issues. There's anger issues here. This person that is angry is may end up in handcuffs. Okay, this is this is something you never saw coming. So this is this is an uproar. Okay, this is a shock. This is a permanent loss. This isn't a fight. This is this is extreme. This is a loss. This is something you never saw coming. Okay, so somebody's foundation is about to be rocked. Okay, something is about to be crumble. Okay, their stability, their security, their their. Um, <laughs> They're about to, somebody is about to experience a rude awakening. And it's coming from an individual who is pissed. Okay, this woman, and I feel like it's a woman. It, it could be a male, but whoever this person is, I'm sick of it. I'm sick of the partying. I'm, I, 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 I'm sick of the third party situation. And I, I'm sick of the girls. I'm sick of the women. I'm, I'm sick of it. So I think there's going to be an outburst. I think there's going to be an outburst. There's going to be a fight and the cops get called. And um, I don't know, maybe somebody ends up going to court or something like that. Good luck. Somebody could end up being arrested as well. Good luck.